I am alone. I have forced everyone away from me. Because I, I must be alone. I am a disease eating away at the kindness others have shown me. I have chosen to render myself dead to the world. Just as my legs have become dead to me. How are you feeling today? I feel fine, Dr. Adams. Well, you don't look fine, Simon. How have you been sleeping? Fine. Now, Simon, if we're gonna make any progress here, you're gonna have to open up a little. Why the hell would I open up to you? I may as well be talking to a brick wall. Dr. Purnell, listen. He heard me. He tried to understand. His death must have taken quite a toll on you. I called Sophie. I asked her to come and see you, Simon. She hasn't visited in a long time, and I thought... Call her back and tell her not to come here. It was a kind gesture, Dr. Adams. I told her to stop coming. My happiness became too dependent on her. More and more each visit wore her down until the look in her eyes said nothing but pity. I'm a burden. Legs or not, I was always a burden. Simon, I... I have to take this, Simon, but I want to talk about this when I get back. 